If we want to stop the boats then we must tackle starvation in Africa first, warns a senior foreign office minister. If Britain wants to stop the boats of illegal migrants landing on its shores then it must tackle starvation in Africa first, a senior minister warned. Foreign Office Minister Andrew Mitchell, responsible for international aid and the voice of Foreign Secretary Lord Cameron in the Commons, spoke to the Daily Express about his plan to tap. His intervention has come in the wake of the fallout of the Supreme Court overruling the government's Rwanda deportation scheme which has meant that its deterrent for illegal migrants has been blocked. With the war in Ukraine hitting grain supplies, starvation on the continent is set to get much worse and with it the mass movement of migrants to Europe and the UK. Now he is set to launch a government white paper on Monday, International Development in a Contested World, Ending Extreme Poverty and Tax. Mr Mitchell said, the great scourges we face at the moment, which are climate change, mass migration, pandemics, terrorism and protectionism, all require greater international cooperation, the result is so much better. He warned that cooperation has gone roaring backwards after progress between 1990 and 2020 partly because of war in Ukraine and Israel, he said, if you're going to tackle those things you need, you need more international cooperation, and you need to change the system, as well, internationally. And that's the white paper, I think there's a contribution to that, that thinking. The government is also hosting a food security summit of experts and governments on Monday. The white paper is an important part of an international roadmap to 2030 to tackle destabilizing catastrophes such as famine and climate.